good to see you again this week. If you recall last week, uh, I shared with you about the context of Matthew chapters 10 and 11, and it's turmoil, trouble, trial, facing of death, and really Jesus speaking into that and, and, and pronouncing woe upon those who are unrepentant and uh, are not following him. And then we come to this amazing passage at the end of Matthew chapter 11. It's verses 25 through 30. We're going to focus on verses 25 through 27 today because Jesus sort of sets up uh, why he can say what he says in verses 28 through 30, the more famous of the two passages. It says in Matthew 11:25 25 and 20 through 27, at that time Jesus declared, I thank you, Father, Lord of heaven and earth, that you have hidden these things from the wise and understanding and revealed them to little children. Yes, Father, for such was your gracious will. All things have been handed over to me by my Father, and no one knows the Son except the Father, and no one knows the Father except the Son, and anyone to whom the Son chooses to reveal him. Now there's a lot of doctrine in that passage about God choosing people to whom he will reveal that his Father is really God, uh, that, that Jesus will reveal that the Father is really God, etc. And that's important, important stuff. I want to focus, though, on what Jesus says before that. He talks about revealing things to people, and he says, you've hidden these things from the wise and understanding and revealed them to little children, because that was your gracious will. It's not the first time Jesus has said something about faith of a child or attitude and disposition of a child. These children come to me. Um, so, in our turmoils and trials of life, not to be simplistic, but to treat it as a simple walk of faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. So today, I don't know what's going on in your life. Things are probably uh, difficult in some sector or another. It usually is that way. There's usually something that's sort of running in our background. And I want to just amplify Jesus call that he reveals himself essentially to those who come to him with the simplest of faith, the most trusting uh, childlike faith and a full dependence and say, I need you. I need you. So in this hour today, uh, whenever you're listening to this, I pray that this truth just sort of uh, lasers into your heart and you recognize and I recognize that we come to the Lord in a simple walk of faith and we trust him and it's revealed to us as though to little children what he what he will do and where he will provide and what he directs in so i want to just encourage you in that today and then we're going to get to that great passage next week about what that coming really looks like and what the outcomes of the of it really are until then god bless you i love you take care